Shalom, brothers and sisters. Shalom. Now, we, I want to come here this evening and talk a little bit about this coronavirus and uh, being prepared for the coronavirus. Now, uh, this, this coronavirus is spreading all around the globe. Um, here in the United States, it's spreading as well. Um, I mean, you could go, these, these diseases are running rampant all around the globe. You can uh, go to the Center for Disease Control website, and you can find a whole list of viruses, diseases, and bacteria. You can look on the back of a can of Lysol. There's a whole list of diseases and viruses and bacteria. Now, if you're quarantined, this virus spreads so badly. It's widespread. They shut down your job. They close its doors. And you're ordered by the federal government to quarantine and isolate yourself and your family inside your home, inside your residence. Now, do you have enough food to last four weeks, five, six weeks? Now, I don't know if you're prepared or not. I don't know if folks are really prepared for that. Now, if you don't have no food, the grocery store doesn't shut down. There's martial law out there on the streets. Businesses have closed. You're ordered to stay inside. Now the, the National Guard and soldiers, troops, and military vehicles with AK-47s are going to be patrolling the streets. Now if you're called outside and you're ordered to be inside, you're mandated to keep you and your family inside because of the spread of this virus and you, you go out here because you didn't have enough food to feed the family after a week or two you done run out of food so here you are up here at 12 o'clock 1 o'clock in the morning walking up here looking to loot or rob a store to feed your family you get singled out by the police by the SWAT team soldier done caught you caught you out Roaming around, ripping and romping when you're ordered to stay inside. It's not going to be good, folks, if you're not prepared. Hey, as this coronavirus is, keep on spreading. More and more cases are reported in the cities, spreading like wildfire. More and more cases are coming out of the woodwork. We hope you're stocking up on some canned food. Whenever your job closes its doors, I don't know if you can afford to stock up on more canned food or not. Hope you have some food, clean drinking water to feed your family. Because once it all closes down, it all closes and shuts down. To avoid the spread of this coronavirus, you're going to have to stay inside your home. Let that sink in for just a few minutes there. Ordered, mandated by the federal government to stay inside your home. Isolate, quarantine you and your family inside your residence for weeks and weeks on end. Until you're allowed to come out and go back to work. Your job opens back up. The coronavirus has leveled off. It's not spreading as, as quickly and abundantly as it once was. Will you survive? Is your family going to be able to survive and be prepared for this coronavirus? That's the question. Prepare. Stock up on plenty of clean drinking water, plenty of canned food, the coronavirus is running rampant all around the globe. Shalom. Shalom.